Hello, today I'm going to show you how you can edit an EEG in the updated iSync Wave app. If you haven't gotten your update already, you can do so by going to Settings, App Version, and hitting Update. This will open the Google Play Store where the new version of the app can be downloaded. To edit an EEG, you can go to the Manage Results tab. There is still our Analysis Results tab as it was before, but there's a new section called Measurement Results. In here, we can see the raw EEGs and whether the data has been uploaded. You can also select and delete data in this menu. Now, if we were to view a raw EEG, you'll see there's a new screen. On here, just as always, you can scroll through your data, but you also notice you can see your timestamps and time regions. You also, if you drag any of the 19 channels on the far left hand side, you can see if specific channels overlap to check for whether or not certain areas are artifact or not. On the same topic of artifact removal, you also now have the ability to select data to either cut or to add. So for example, if I want to select here, I tap the timestamp I want to start my selection and then tap the timestamp that I want to end my selection. You can hit the X in the top to reselect the data if you need to, and then hit this pencil in the bottom and you can choose whether you want to save this data so you can save it as a new file, or if you want to cut this data. Any data that you cut can be undone by hitting the rewind button at the top of that menu. If you go ahead and select data and then hit the save button, it'll save just that area and remove everything else. Now, if I were to select some data, cut it, hit cut, the data is now removed from my recording. I can hit the save button, the arrow in the bottom right, and choose if I want to overwrite the data I already have in this file, or if I want to save it as a new data. Any overwritten data is lost, so be careful if you choose to overwrite. The last thing to note on here is you can still, just as always, hit the play button at the top right to view the data in real time. You can skip ahead or rewind in three second intervals with those little rewind and fast forward buttons next to the play button. You can select different montages and you can change your scale. You also have the ability to view your timestamps by hitting the timestamp button at the bottom. You can see the duration of each time window and when the onset was. And you can go ahead and tap any of those to skip to the onset time. So that is how to edit an EEG in the new iSync Wave app.